Hey guys, today I want to show you how to uh, add a watermark to your photos using um, App Apple's Aperture 3. Um, if you don't know how to make a watermark, a see-through watermark, um, you can check out some of my other tutorials. I have a Photoshop CS4 tutorial um, that should be able to walk you through making a watermark. Um, if you're not sure, Here's what uh, my watermark looks like. Um, but yeah, anyway, if you, if you want to learn how to make a watermark, um, just check out my other tutorials and you can find a tutorial that will walk you through making one. Um, but in this tutorial, I'm going to focus purely on adding the watermark uh, to your photos um, on export on with Aperture 3. So if you're going to uh, export the photos, um, onto the web, put them on a forum, add them to a website, whatever, and you want some sort of identifying marks to uh, show people who took the photo and to protect your photos, um, you can add a watermark. So first things first, uh, I'm going to open up Apple, uh, Aperture 3 and uh, I'm going to add a watermark to this photo right here. So the first step, once you have Aperture open, is to go up to the Aperture menu up here, click on Presets, and then click on image export. Okay? Now, um, for web uploads, I usually use um, 1024 by 1024. Um, you can use any size you want, it doesn't make any difference. Um, for this tutorial, I'm going to use 1024 by 1024. Um, but you can, using any of these presets here, you can, you can do the same thing, just follow the same steps. Um, so, anyway, so. Um, once you click on the preset you want, uh, in this case I'm going to use 1024 by 1024, then go down here, select the image format, uh, image quality, um, I'm going to put a 12, I'm going to pick original size because it's already going to reduce uh, the photo size for me right here. Um, and then uh, check this little checkbox right here that says show watermark, and then click choose image and uh, navigate to the folder that uh, you saved your watermark in that you made it, uh, that you made in using Photoshop CS4 before. Um, mine is in my photos folder so I'm going to go to uh, my home folder click on pictures and then here's my watermark right here uh, PSD. So I'm going to choose that and then you can adjust the opacity for the watermark. I usually like to do 50% but it's up to you. Um, but I'm going to do 50% then click Oh, and make sure you check this box that uh, it says scale watermark right here. If you don't have this box here, it won't adjust the watermark uh, according to the size of your picture. So make sure you check that box and then click OK. Now, now that we're back in uh, the normal library function on Aperture 3, right click on the photo, go to export version. And then for export preset, make sure you pick the preset that you set the watermark for. So for this one I'm going to do 1024 by 2024 again because that's what I adjusted the preset for. And then I'm going to save it to my desktop. And now here's my photo on my desktop. And if I double click on it, you'll see it has my watermark right here. So uh, if you have any other questions, please let me know. Uh, feel free to leave comments, rate, whatever. Um, and leave me questions and I can make new tutorials for you guys. All right, I hope that helps. Take care.